हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम डॉक्टर हिमांशु गुप्ता एंड आई हैव डन माय एम बी बी एम डी फ्रॉम मौलाना आजाद मेडिकल कॉलेज आई हैड गॉट अ रैंक ऑफ सिक्सटी टू नीट पी टू थाउजेंड एंड आई एम आल्सो अ फैकल्टी एट पी डब्ल्यू मेरेड सो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस विद यू द लास्ट थ्री मंथ स्ट्रैटेजी नो दैट इज गोइंग टू हेल्प यू सिक्योर गुड रैंक इन दी नीट पी जी सो गाइज आई हैव बीन गेटिंग अ लॉट ऑफ मैसेजेस फ्रॉम द स्टूडेंट्स सर आई हैव स्टार्टेड लेट इन दी प्रिपरेशन राइट आई एम नॉट गेटिंग गुड मार्क्स इन दी ग्रैंड टेस्ट सो कैन आई क्लियर दिस एग्जाम राइट सो का इज द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग इन इन दिस एग्जाम टू इज टू हैव अ पॉजिटिव माइंड सेट यू ऑलवेज हैव टू थिंक दैट यू आर डेफिनेटली गोइंग टू डू वेल इन दिस मेन एग्जाम राइट यू आर डेफिनेटली गोइंग टू डू वेल नो मैटर वॉट इज दिस सिचुएशन you always have to be positive even if you stay positive only then you will be able to give positive hard work only then you will be able to study you know with all your heart if if doubts start coming in your mind ki yaar mera ho sakta hai ya mera nahi ho sakta okay then it it, it is going to get worse for you so the the most important thing is that is to have a positive mindset that i am going to clear the exam with a very good result i am going to get good marks no matter what is my present situation even if i am not getting good marks in the grand test okay they are going to improve okay i will tell you i will share one incident from my neat pe preparation so when i was preparing for the exam initially what used to happen out of 300 questions i always used to get 160 questions 170 questions correct just even you know 3 months before the exam but suddenly you know my score improved like this my score improved like this just 2 months before the exam so the most important thing is that you keep on working hard right if you stop working if you think negatively nothing good is going to happen right so the best thing is positive mindset and keep on doing your best right then guys you know you also have to think that these are the three months okay even if you have not studied well in the past these are the three months that can change your future right you can get the branch of your choice you can get the college of your choice you know and you know you you have the time with you you have the you know sometimes you know people keep on blaming other things ki yaar iske karan meri preparation achhi nahi hui okay never blame never blame on anyone right do not blame anyone for anything so you know people keep on blaming thing ki yaar iski wajah se main aaj pad nahi paya uski wajah se meri padhai kharab ho gayi right but i am telling you okay you have the last 3 months with you right do not blame anyone just give your best and you know your future your future is going to change your future is going to change the day you get your you know medicine surgery radiology any branch of your choice right so jo hamare paas time hai us par focus karo jo beet gaya so beet gaya theek hai now students will ask me sir how to plan the next 3 months right so the most important thing for planning is you know to keep a pen and a paper with you right write down all the days okay divide the days divide the days between different subjects this is the most important thing that needs to be done once you make a rough plan on a paper and stick it on your table right you will definitely try to follow it and you will get some clarity right you will not get a clarity by a teacher telling you ki yaar tu aaj 5 din is iske upar laga 5 din iske upar laga okay 10 days iske upar 3 days uske upar you are not kids you know how to do this right but the most important thing is that you take a pen and a paper you take a pen and a paper and you divide you know your time Uh, between different subjects right you must be having one subject week devote more time on that subject 
right so ideally what can be done 45 30 15 days right 45 days for this read right then 30 days for another read and 15 days for another read right so guys one thing i would like to tell you right this thing is that you know this last month okay the third last month i would say is the month where you can you know freely sub study your weak subjects because weak subjects are something you know that will improve your marks in the grand test that will improve your rank also in the main exam so this is the best time to focus on the weak subjects because as we will move forward you know during the last two months the anxiety is going to increase right so when the anxiety increases it is very difficult to to pick up new things to pick up new topics right so this is the month where you can focus on the weak subjects if psm is your weak subject try to do the psm in this month don't worry even if you devote more time right because this is the this is the subject that is going to increase your marks in everything and that is going to improve your rank as well so weak subjects or weak subtopics also no not only subjects agar <coughs> if there is any uh, subject which you know is me mereko ye wala topic acha nahi aata ya ye wala system acha nahi aata then focus on that system right this is the right time and uh, at pw method you know we have uh, revision videos also so at this time you know your only source should be your only source should be notes right but definitely what you can do you can definitely uh, pick up videos of those subjects in which you are you know not doing well so that will help you you know form your concepts in shorter period of time now there are few subjects uh, you know volatile subjects like pharmacology right like uh, your microbiology these are the subjects which students forget a lot so what you can do about these subjects so i will tell you you know my senior told me for weak subjects what you can do you can read these subjects on a daily basis so this is the way this is the way to tackle the volatile subjects thoda thoda daily padho yaar pharma ke 10 15 dag daily pad liye microbiology mein ek do bacteria daily pad liya hai na अगर तुम फार्माकोलॉजी और माइक्रोबायोलॉजी फोर फाइव डेज में कंप्लीट कर दोगे देन अगेन यू आर गोइंग टू फरगेट इट सो द बेस्ट थिंग इज दैट यू ट्राई टू डू दी सब्जेक्ट्स ऑन अ डेली बेसिस राइट नाउ आई वांट टू टेल अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट अबाउट रिवीजन राइट सो समाइम्स यू नो स्टूडेंट सेम ही वी आर नॉट एबल टू रिमेंबर थिंग्स सो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू दैट रेपिटेशन इज द वे ओके सो रेपिटेशन कैसे करनी आई विल टेल यू अगर जैसे अभी मैंने आपको बताया आई टोल्ड यू दैट फार्माकोलॉजी यू हैव टू स्टडी डेली राइट फॉर एग्जांपल ऑन द फर्स्ट डे यू स्टडी टेन ड्रग्स ऑफ ए एन एस टेन ड्रग्स ऑफ ए एन एस ऑन द सेकेंड डे यू स्टडी टेन ड्रग्स ऑफ सी वी एस तो वॉट यू कैन डू गाइस वॉट यू कैन डू वेन यू आर स्टडिंग द टेन ड्रग्स ऑफ सी वी एस ट्राई टू रिवाइज द टेन ड्रग्स ऑफ ए एन एस ऑल्सो राइट एंड दिस इज on on the third day when you are reading cns when you are reading cns then along with cns revise the drugs of ans plus cvs and slowly and slowly you will see that if you follow this technique right you are going to revise pharmacology you know multiple times and this is how you are going to remember the drugs and same thing you can follow for for uh, microbiology also you study three bacteria every day then on the second day revise the previous three bacteria on the third day revise the previous six bacteria on the fourth day revise the previous nine bacteria right this way it is going to take you less time to complete the uh, microbiology and it is also going to you know help you remember things for a longer period of time right so this is one technique which i followed during my preparation with a call as the wall technique so what is this wall technique so whatever that you are not able to remember just try to paste it on the wall paste it on the wall of your room and to this wall devote at least you know 30 minutes daily 
read you know you can paste i had pasted you know on one wall i had pasted important drugs of pharmacology right on one wall there were mix of things so when i was devoting 30 minutes daily to you know reading those things you can just make five sticky notes five sticky notes daily and when you read these things daily you know you are revising also a few of the things that you forget you revise it a lot of number times and also what happens you know you are going through a number of subjects when that sticky note is a mix of so many things you are revising those things a number of times right so this is one thing that you can do and three hour revision rule so guys what is this three hour revision rule now most of you guys must be in the second read even if you are in the first read or third read i would definitely ask you to follow this rule so what is this three hour so within the revision also you have to revise things what do i mean revise right so for example if you have revised anatomy today upper limb so what you have to do on the second day okay devote some time to the on the second day devote some time to revise upper limb along with lower limb right the way you were following it for pharmacology and pharmacology and microbiology right take out some time to revise these things then what you can do along with revising what you have already done in the last day try to revise what you have read in the last week for example in the last week you studied forensic medicine right so daily one hour daily one hour daily try to revise forensic medicine so one hour should be dedicated to revising things that you had studied in the last day one hour to things that you have studied in the last month and one hour to the things you have studied in the last week so see many students will ask sir itna sab kuch 1 ghante mein kaise kar payenge 1 ghante mein jitna bhi ho raha utna karna hai hame ye nahi sochna ki yaar 1 ghante mein main sara revise kar paunga nahi kar paunga initially you may not be able to revise everything but as time will pass you will see you are revising a lot of things so just try to revise whatever you can revise theek hai now what should be the source your major source should be the notes that you have prepared unko itni baar padho itni baar padho theek hai na padhte raho bas theek hai and you know if there are if there are subjects you are having some problem you are not able to study okay you are finding the subjects boring or your subject is weak even after reading your notes you can refer to the pw merit videos theek hai you can you can you can refer to other sources right you can go for the uh, you can go for the video lectures you can look at the textbook you can google okay whatever you are not understanding just google right but try to make your concept as i told you this is the month this is the month to focus on the weak subjects so if even if you have to read something extra okay don't hesitate don't hesitate to go for it read that extra thing right and also one more thing that i would like to tell you okay even q bank also okay even if you have completed your q bank just do your q bank again do your q bank again that is the best way okay so this this will be your main source write notes and you know even if you need to read something extra from the textbook right if if you know ki yaar this is an important topic which i don't understand don't hesitate okay just devoting half an hour okay to reading things from an extra place that is never going to harm you okay if you are able to you know improve on that topic if you are able to improve that subject theek hai ab now how to improve marks in the grand test theek hai simple sa tarika batata hu marks in the grand test just focus on the weak subjects focus on the weak subjects and weak topics ye kahan se pata chalenge grand test analysis okay so grand test analyze your grand test which are the subjects in which you are getting less than 30 percent marks right focus on those subjects and if in a grand test you are finding 
that there is a topic there is a topic that is not good okay that you are not able to that you are not able to remember well okay or that is very frequently asked in the exam so for that topic okay just mark that topic within your notes and try to focus and try to devote more time and this is the only way this is the only way there is no other way to improve your marks in the grand test right so guys this was all i i hope that this short video is going to help you and just keep on studying keep on working hard okay just uh, try to give your best and rest leave everything on the court bye bye guys take care keep working hard